welcome back to Crazy Hank TV. Today I want to talk about the greatness of Henry Winkler. Now obviously most of us know him from Happy Days. It's Arthur Fonzarelli, the Fonz, a larger than life character. We all wanted to be the Fonz. I remember as a kid, I, I thought he was cool. Of course, that's what his character was supposed to be, cool. He was a huge, huge star. Even people that didn't watch the show knew who the Fonz was. You knew that Fonz was on Happy Days. If you said Arthur Fonzarelli, Happy Days. And to Henry Winkler's credit, usually a character like that, you get typecast. You can't shake being the Fonz. Hey, you just can't do it. But he's such a great actor that he was able to go on and have, if you look at his, his, his career, it's a long, long list. This would be a 45-minute video if I listed everything that he has been in. I think for me, took me away from him being the Fonz was his movie he did with Night Shift, directed by Ron Howard, starring Shelley Long, Michael Keaton. It was a great, great movie because the character was completely different than the Fonz. He wasn't cool. He wasn't tough. He let everyone walk all over him. It was really the perfect role in a great movie. It's a funny movie. If you haven't seen it, it's hilarious. It's it's fantastic movie. I believe it was Michael Keaton's first big break. Basically he plays an accountant who works in a morgue at night because he doesn't he just can't handle the stress of being an accountant. Again, he lets everybody walk all over him, which the Fonz would never do. It was a hit. It worked. I think that's what pushed people's image of him. Plus, again, he's been in so many different shows. Arrested Development. It's just amazing. I, like I said, most actors, when you're typecast like that, like say Bob Denver from Gilligan's Island, you could never forget that Bob Denver, not that Bob Denver wasn't a good actor, but you could never forget that he was Gilligan. Am I right? Now we have the Fonz, and you completely forget about the, you don't ever forget that he was the Fonz, but you accept the roles that he is in. And now, he's in the dark, dark, dark comedy, Barry. If you haven't seen it, it is hilarious, but it is dark. I'm just going to give you heads up ahead of time. He plays Gene Kuzinov, an actor who's been teaching acting because he can't be hired because he's just a not a nice person. <laughs> but he does a fantastic job, starring Bill Hader also. And it's just, it has scenes in there that are so damn funny, but... His character he plays is just a complete opposite of the Fonz. Again, just fantastic. And he was just nominated for an Emmy for Best Supporting Actor in a Comedy. Well-deserved. I hope he wins it because Henry Winkler is an American treasure. Love the guy. I don't know him, but I love the guy. For all the entertainment he has given to me and millions of others, over the year. That's all we got. Let me know what you think in the comments section. Do you love Henry Winkler? And also, like the Fonz would do, he would give this video a thumbs up. That's all we got. Thanks for watching. I'm out. Bye, everybody.